I think exponential technologies in general are becoming a real case of, of disruption. In this video, you are going to learn which technologies will shape the future and what Mark's main criteria are for investing. Mark Bernecker is a serial web entrepreneur and fintech investor. He co-founded Usgang.ch and Amyando, was awarded as a global technology pioneer by the World Economic Forum. Mark has been active as a fintech investor since 2010, bought his first bitcoins in 2012, and is fascinated by the opportunities this new asset class has to offer. Focusing on cryptocurrencies and institutional investors, I think there's an increasing demand. More and more serious players are looking at uh, cryptocurrencies as a new emerging asset class, which is here to stay. And more and more portfolios are at least taking into consideration to allocate a small portion of their assets into cryptocurrencies. And I think that's already a big step forward compared to the whole ecosystem a few years ago. I think exponential technologies in general are becoming a real case of, of disruption. Everybody talks about disruptive technologies, but I rather talk about exponential technologies. And when we look at the development of other exponential technologies in the past, I think it's something we already saw uh, in the early days of the 20th century, now just in a far more accelerated way. The main advice would be to broaden the focus, not just focusing on the buzzwords like digitization or digital transformation, and really uh, take into consideration that exponential technologies go far further and have a far bigger impact than just a digital revolution. As an export-oriented uh, nation where we mainly have our brains as capital and no other traditional commodities, um, we always have to be in front of new developments and I think Switzerland is very well positioned to also export these new exponential technologies and behaviors to other markets. I would also personally take the fact that we have far more accelerated exponential technologies in literally all industries into consideration. And as most uh, early stage venture capitalists or investors say, you shouldn't focus on a percentage increase of an existing value change and rather really look for the 10 to 100x business cases. So really an incremental change of existing value chains and business cases.